Well, hello and welcome to everybody who has joined us for what is a very, very special occasion. It is, of course, Super Cup Day, a clash of two mighty teams who were, without question, the greatest contributors to last season's excitement. All condensed into this game, then, the teams will be aiming to repeat what they did last time round and demanding of themselves every ounce of focus. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. A serious game of the season, Jim. What do you think about it? It falls somewhere in between friendly and, and fully competitive, I would say. Yes, you want to win a trophy, but you also know that it won't be the end of the world if you don't. I think pressure levels are, are lower, but then your competitive edge can't allow you to make it too easy for the opposition. So you have to give this what it demands. the way Sergio Busquets this is promising done very well to intervene and it's played forward now the counter Carlos Soler forward it goes it's Rodrigo very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Jordi Alba. Arthur. Sergio Busquets. Roberto. In by Roberto. Well, there's something you don't see every day. Arthur tries to get it forward quickly. Piccini. Jeffrey Condobbia. Diacabi drives it forward. Anything, Jim, to pick out of these early exchanges? Well, neither side has really grabbed the initiative, I would say. Both must have come in with a view of, of not making any early mistakes. So we're seeing some conservatism here. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Arthur. And here's Suarez. Sean Domenech gets it upfield. And here's Messi. Piccini. Gaia. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Carlos Soler goes looking. No, too much on it. Jordi Alba. And it's Coutinho. Messi. Messi! Appearance and very necessary. Messi clearly became one-eyed then. He just decided to force it. And 
he's there to clear it. Roberto. Thinks he's got rid of that. Rakitic kings it out wide. Arthur. Hoists it forward. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Chance to shoot, and Messi! Goal! Barcelona! That could turn out to be a big, big goal. A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Messi is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for him. A 1-0 lead established. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. Gaia. Arthur. Valencia have it back and they can... Rodrigo! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class weight. Messi. Good idea, just poorly executed. Well, it seems as if he's just had a moment. And Coutinho! Good first touch and almost as good a second. Ah, that's a great effort. There was very little backlift to indicate what was coming. Rakitic. Coming up to half-time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. Arthur, and it's Jordi Alba. Kondokbio gets it back. Gaia. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1-0. Carlos Soler, a forward pass. Oh, good interception. And for a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Jordi Alba sticks in a foot to win it back. Jordi Alba plays it forward. Half time here. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. What a decent game up today. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job. Barcelona, the happier of the teams, heading in for half time, 1 0 up. And the game has already resumed here. Barcelona carrying a one-goal lead. That'll be a throw-in. So here comes the substitution. Gabriel. Jeffrey Condogbia. Well, it seems obvious that the plan is to, to try and get their passing game going again, but not with that lack of quality. Hoists it forward. Gonzalo Guedes. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. 
Longley. Roberto. Tony Lato drives it forward. It's got through to him. Too much on it. And that's the keepers. Jordi Alba. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Gabriel. Parejo. Gaia. Parejo with the short one. Parejo crosses it in. Oh, that is not what he intended. Roberto. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. And it's messy. Loose ball, who's going to get there? And it's played forward. Diakabi. Diakabi goes looking. Forward it goes. Pique knocks it away. Longley. Rakitic. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, this lead is beginning to look a little delicate. I'd rather see them show the ambition and adventure to go further ahead. But Gonzalo Guedes! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Rakitic. Good challenge. He just stood firm. PK. Jordi Alba. And he's going long. PK does well to read it and intercepts. Jeffrey Condogbia. Gonzalo Guedes. Plays it out to the flank. And that's one way to annoy his teammates. Arthur just brushed off the ball there. And here's Camero. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. And it's messy. It's a brilliant interception. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Gomez has a hit! Should have equalised. That was extremely good focus from the keeper, and it could turn out to be quite a significant moment. Sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Condogbia. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Should have been two. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. <laughs> it's 
Sergio Busquets. Shapes to shoot. This could fall anywhere. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. He's, he's gone for it! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Changes here from both sides, in fact. They've played it short. Longley battles to win it back. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Parejo. Quick run. And the shot! It's broken loose. Same again, same outcome. They're just lacking a cutting edge, Peter, and while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. Oh. And the referee brings it to a close. A huge result. A place in the next round is theirs to lose now. Success on away territory, a lead to protect at home, it is looking really good. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Well, to me, this is a result, Peter, that says an awful lot more than the scoreline suggests. You know, after the goal, the team just settled down and, and looked surprisingly comfortable and didn't really need to work too hard. Very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. The Camp Nou once again decorated in the colours of Barcelona. This is what greets the players every time. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. Barcelona bring a useful lead into their home game, having won the first leg on the road. And that is as far as they're going to go. Roberto. And here's Rakitic. Coutinho. And Coutinho! Just off target. Well, even for him, that may have been a touch ambitious. And that's been lever clear. Rakitic gets it back. Roberto goes looking. Well positioned to make that interception.
And it's played forward. Gaia. Was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Roberto drills one in, has a hit! Surely this time! Oh, denied brilliantly! Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Longley tries to get it forward quickly. Roberto. No goals as yet. Longley. Jordi Alba. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Pique. Roberto. And it's Messi. Driving on, he could shoot here. He hits it. He's pulled off a fine save. Arturo simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Vass. Piccini. Parejo. In he goes again! Decent enough try. Gamero did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Played back in. And it's Perejo. He's had to end the finish! Oh, shame, that was nicely worked. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. behind a oh, good play all round he was well hustled and, and still got a shot away Philippe Coutinho and here's Suarez done very well to intervene Parejo Forward it goes. Ruben Sobrino finds himself offside. Camero, he's played him through. Ruben Sabrino was brushed off the ball there. Coutinho tries lifting it over. Zabufa looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Foot in. Messi looking to get on the end of this. It's a brilliant interception. Barcelona have themselves a corner, I think. Yes, they do. Chance! This could fall anywhere. Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. 
Sergio Roberto is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. And the volley. Ruben Sobrino. And it's been taken straight back. It's half time. So both sides have drawn breaks. They have twirled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Well, it's become an exercise in, in preservation, Peter. I think it's been a much more even affair. And there's no need for them to take any unnecessary risks. They look happy to frustrate and contain and, and just wait for a chance then. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. The action has already resumed here. Barcelona clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Jeffrey Condogbia. Condogbia plays it forward. Gamero gets it out to the wing. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Ruben Sabrino. Roberto. Jordi Alba. Oh, he's not going to get that. And it's Luis Suarez. And here's Messi. Balassi. Gabriel drives it forward. Balassi. Roberto did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Messi is onto it and can take it up. Messi. Good challenge, excellent challenge. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw, some real no-nonsense defending. He's one-on-one, -on -one, surely! Well, it's good stuff, this is better. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this, it really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. to be more accurate. Parejo. Hoists it forward. Gamero really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to... Big shot! Luis Suarez! Jeffrey Condogbia. Balassi. Kondogbia drives it forward. Has gone out. Valencia can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Well, the referee's seen the board and he's going to allow a double change to go ahead now. Philippe Coutinho. And it's Messi. Now it's Luis Suarez. He's through. It's Luis Suarez! Oh, it's got in! Listen, I've experienced that both for and against, and you won't have to guess which one I preferred. That really is quite fabulous. All his own doing. I think he just thought about trying his look from further out there, but why bother when you can worm your way through a defence like that? It's, it's terrific play to, to get through and score. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. 
And once more, they can't get through. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, his instinct and the timing of his runs have proven fruitful, but they have to give him a harder time like that. In once more. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. been cleared. Has a pop! The Mero battles to win it back. I have to say that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Forward it goes. Hits one! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Well, he's clearly not the only one who can't believe he didn't put it away. I think he's going to take some ribbon for that. Jordi Alba cuts it out. Nice clear cut. It's a free kick. Barcelona are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. And he's going long. He's picked him out. He has it out wide now. He's got away. It's broken loose. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Being played forward, and here's Messi. Got offside that time. Keeper sends it forward. Carlos Elena. Messi. Now it's Philippe Coutinho. Right through the middle. He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. Now it's Camero. Dangerous looking ball. It's come to nothing. And it's messy. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Loses his balance and loses the ball. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. Barcelona have won it in what has been the perfect end to the pre-season. And whilst it's no guarantee of success when the new campaign does get underway in a week or so, it is surely a significant boost to morale and a significant statement of intent. Now the moment, the ceremony and the presentation of the trophy to come, the very first trophy of a new season. So many more might follow, how many we will find out over the course of the months ahead.